What's going on YouTube? You're chilling with Trainer Zabza, and we are here today for some more Showdown Dailies. Uh, this time we're going to be going with my Little Cup, and this is my Unburdened Trico team. I saw that Unburdened Trico was now legal in Little Cup, so I wanted to give it a shot. Um, this is kind of an odd set. Uh, it's a physical set with Sword Stance, Seed Bomb, Acrobatics, and Drain Punch. Berry Juice Unburdened with Max H- I think this is Max HP. Uh, max HP, little bit in speed, max attack, and that little bit in speed is because, you know, with little cup speed tiers, unless something is 18 speed, unless it's 20 speed and scarfed, uh, 14 speed is great to outspeed all scarfers, because, you know, if you have 18 speed, which is, uh, 18 speed scarfer, that's gonna be 27, so you outspeed that just barely. So, this is a pretty good speed for unburden or agility users, stuff like that. I have a utility archon with, uh, Ruse, Defog, Stealth Rock, Seat Bomb, or not Seat Bomb, what am I saying, that was the other one, uh, Roost, Defog, Stealth Rock, Rock Tomb, because if I can get their speed down, it's actually more damaging, it's more damaging to faster opponents if I lower their speed, then hit them. Uh, Hone Edge with Shadow Sneak, Sacred Sword, Iron Head, and Sword Stance, I just threw Sword Stance on there, it's just, it's mainly physically offensive, but also physically defensive. It's it's just there for shits and giggles, and I put a little bit in speed because not only would the EVs not go anywhere else, but because um, I'm sorry, I'm looking up at a different camera. I'm like looking up at this one, but I'm supposed to be looking at this one. I actually can't take this down. Okay, better. So now I'm just looking directly at you guys. Uh, anyway, just yeah, I think you guys get the point with that hone edge. A especially offensive hound hour with my custom set. A specially defensive launcher, I wanted to give this a try with Rest, Sleep Talk, Water Pulse, and U-Turn. Water Pulse for Stab and Mega Launcher, and U-Turn just for some um, switch initiative, just in case. And a physically defensive Wooper, I'm kind of screwed if I run into a Grass type, but I've got like three that resist it, so hopefully I'm okay. Fungus would pretty much screw this team over, not gonna lie. Uh, the only way I could get around that is with Hone Edge or Hound Hour, but it could just put them to sleep, so that's not exactly ideal. Anyway, physically defensive Wooper, um, yeah, just kind of standard set. No stockpile this time, just Toxic, because I want to be able to have something on my team of Toxic, just in case I need to stall a little bit. And, yeah, that's pretty much it. Let's go ahead and look for a battle. Um, I'm pretty high on the, on the ladder, so I imagine I'm going to need to cut to it when I get to it, so I will see you guys then. Oh, looks like I found one. Uh, DJ520, let's say good luck, have fun. Ooh, this is kind of a threatening team. Um, I imagine me and Fu or... There's actually a good chance that me and Fu or Blitzel will lead. So, I'm think. Oh, I don't have a knockoff counter for this team. That's not good. Okay. What would be good against me and Fu? Probably Trico. Honestly, probably Trico. Because if I can lead with Trico then that means I'll get my Unburden boost, I can go for Sword Stance, and I can Acrobatics. Because I don't think many Tricos carry Acrobatics, so that'll be a surprise. And it's not like, as long as it's not like full physically offensive, it should be fine. Sandile. I don't think this can kill me. I will give the, I think I can actually set up on this because they usually just go for Sword Stance. So I will give this a shot. I know I shouldn't be setting up so early in the match, but I think I could on it. Fire Fang? Okay. Well, I'm glad I did that. I can seriously set up on that and then just see bomb and kill it. Darmaka. This is probably a Scarfer, but a Scarf Darmaka will not outspeed me. Um, Drain Punch should actually be enough to knock it out. Yep, there we go. I may actually sweep with this thing. This be, That'd be pretty cool. Me and Fu, I knew that was coming, so acrobatics, fake out, uh, it did not appreciate that. But let's go ahead and go for acrobatics. It's gone, I'm glad I put acrobatics on there. Here's Staryu, definitely gonna see bomb I could drain punch, but I'm just, I want that thing dead. Wow, am I gonna get a first turn sweep with Trico? Trico of all things, Trico? <laughs> Here's Ghastly, I'm gonna have to acrobatics, I can't do anything else. Ah, dude, why didn't you send this out before? It's sashed. You could have sent it out before. Well, where's the logic? 
Okay. Just okay. I'm wondering where the logic is there, but I... I okay. You have to know I have Shadow Sneak. You have to know I have Shadow Sneak. Why would you Shadow Ball when you know I have Shadow Sneak? Alright, Shadow Sneak. Screw it. I think he'd go into Sandile now. He did show Fire Fang. I think I'd be okay with going into Wooper. I might just go for the... Uh, no. I'm not gonna go for the Shadow Sneak. I might need, I might save it, because I might need Shadow Sneak for Blitzel. That's a real possibility, because Blitzel is very fast. It is really, really fast. I think it actually hits 20 speed. It might not. It might hit 18. I don't know if this is physical or special, but either way, I think I'll be okay going into Wooper. Uh... Flame Charge. Okay. It's a mixed set? I don't know. He, he got Flame Charge up, so I imagine that Double Kick. Okay, it's a physical set. That's fine. He must have it on here for Spore Counters, but Earthquake, take it out. No problem. And I think I've got this battle under Rack. I've got the, I think I've got this in the game. It's like an Ice Punch. I'm physically defensive. Sandiles are physically offensive. And I've still got two priority users I can use. Yeah, I'm not physically offensive, man, so <laughs> that foul play does nothing. Really, you'd be better off with Crunch. Well, GG. I can't believe how well Trico did. Holy crap! That just absolutely destroyed. Wow. Wow, just wow. You know what? I'm going to call that a first part because that was amazing. Um, Let's see. Talk of the day. I'm actually going to start doing talk of the days for these showdown dailies. What? How did that happen with Trico? What did you... Guys, what? Just what? <laughs> That's the talk of the day. So, hope you guys all enjoyed. If you did, be sure to leave a like, subscribe, leave a like, subscribe to the channel, and uh, don't forget to check out more of my showdown dailies. So, I'll see you next time. Bye!